Good afternoon, Fredericksburg. I'm Patty Murphy with Long and Foster Homes, and I'm here with Danielle and Sweet Little Bean. Her story's a little confusing um, because we're not really totally sure about her deal, but she is a little love bug. She's a bit timid. Um, when Danielle's petting on her, she's usually wagging her sweet little tail very timidly. She just needs a lot of love and adjustment. There she goes. There's her sweet tail. Um, one thing to keep in mind when you're adopting here at the shelter is there's a three-day threshold, a three-week threshold, and a three-month threshold. The three-day is just them decompressing and detoxing. Um, they'll probably sleep a lot because it's a lot quieter than where they are now. So just keep in mind the adjustment. Then the three weeks is figuring out your routine, what you're expecting of him or her, their food, how often they go potty, all those kind of things. And then after three months, they really start to feel like it's home. So when you come to adopt, please keep those, those time frames in mind because it's really important, particularly for a timid dog like me, really not 100% sure of her story. Um, but please come and meet Bean. It's Patty again with Long and Foster, and I'm here again with Danielle and Hula. This is Hula. He's been here uh, for a little bit longer than we'd like. Um, he's eight years old, so considered a senior dog. German Shepherd primarily. Um, he's shedding right now because I th we think he's stressed out. His first impressions are not fabulous because when you come to his run, um, he jumps and he's really loud and looks like he's a little snappy, but um, it took a couple days and he warmed up to Danielle in no time and you can see he's very comfortable with her. Um, he could use a little bit of a diet, um, but he's, he's a great, I mean, he's just settled in really quickly. So Hula needs an experienced handler, probably somebody that can take time and train him. He can be a bit temperamental. Um, maybe a little quirky and weird, so you need to have a lot of patience with him. We don't really know a lot about Hula's background. Um, I think they had had him for a while and had to turn him in for um, financial reasons. They had adopted him from here before, so he needs a lot of grace, a lot of patience, and probably it's best if he has a German Shepherd handler or someone that's accustomed to temperamental dogs. He's a sweetie. Don't let his uh, behavior in his run uh, discourage you, but definitely you need experience with shepherds. Um, I think he's a really good dog. He's really taken to Danielle and the staff that's here. Um, it takes a couple days to warm up, but please consider him as well. As I mentioned, the time frames for them to adjust is quite extensive, so it's not something that's gonna cut, turn around in a day or two or even a couple weeks. The foster to adopt program is a really good idea here or just being a foster. So please consider coming to Spotsy Shelter to help, to volunteer, to adopt, to foster, to donate. Thank you so much Fredericksburg and enjoy this gorgeous day.